Hi guys. In today's video, as you can tell from the title, I am going to be getting my camera. They just sent me like a confirmation email for me to go pick it up at the store, so that's why I'm currently in my car right now. I'm gonna go get it. I actually like wanted a camera for a really long time now. Well, not that long. Ever since I started YouTube. Yeah, I'm just gonna... Let me tell you guys about my camera story. I wanted to purchase a camera from the Best Buy Marketplace seller. So I bought it, whatever. I saved like a hundred dollars and then they told me that they were gonna ship it and it was gonna come in like four days. So I waited and now they shipped it on February 1st and well, it's February 10th. It still hasn't like came and maybe it's not like the seller's fault because it's kind of like Canada Post's fault, but like I just have no patience and then I did more research and it said like refurbished products are hit or miss. I don't know, I was just really scared that my product was going to be broken or something. Like even though they have a 90 day warranty, if you open the product and you use it, you have to pay 20% for like the like restocking fee or something. So like, I don't know, I just don't think it's worth it. And like, I might as well just invest into like a new camera. I literally just purchased a new one. So I'm just waiting for the old one to come so I can return it. I also don't know where Best Buy is. I've been driving for like, five minutes no idea where it is also if you hear like the bells and stuff it's because um my mom has these like asian things in her car i don't know if it's my turn to go i'll just go oh okay well i have no idea where i'm going yay just waiting for someone to come would you look at that Hey guys, so I'm back home now and I am going to be unboxing my camera the moment that everyone has been waiting for. I got the Canon G7X Mark II and this is what it looks like. The packaging, the box isn't that aesthetically pleasing or anything. The lighting in this room is so bad, but I could not wait until tomorrow. I'm so excited. I was going to get the M50, but I wanted something that was more like compact and like easy to use, I guess. Maybe I will invest in the M50 when I have money in the future. I'm gonna take it out of the packaging. So when you unbox it, this is so inconvenient. The flap is so inconvenient. So the first thing I see here is the SD card. They gave me a 128 gig SD card information sheet that I don't really care about. And there's like a whole thick instruction manual thing that I'm probably not gonna look at. There is this thing, which I don't really know what it is. I think it's the battery charger, the little battery pack. It's so cute, love it. And we have the charger. No, you dumb bitch, it's the wristband. And this is what everyone has been waiting for. Wow, she is gorgeous. Wow, okay, I don't, this is like definitely not working. It's so pretty. Okay, wait. That's really cool. Like, imagine just filming like that. Um, can I turn it on? I think I have to put like a battery or something in it. I have to charge a battery, but I will come back when I can actually turn this camera on. I literally charged my battery for like five minutes and I just put the SD card in. This is a monumental moment. Here we go. Wait, okay, it says to set like all of this. It's touch screen. Okay, wait, I'm gonna try filming on this. No way I just took a picture. I you can like press on the screen to focus it. That's so cool. This quality is so crazy. Like That's disgusting. I don't even have that much lighting in my room. Like the lighting is really bad, but it's like pretty good on this camera, I think. Maybe I should just stick to filming on my phone because quality is so crazy. Yeah, that's the little comparison. I'm gonna be filming the rest of this video on my camera because I'm super excited to use it and I truly hate the quality of my phone. If you made it to the end of this video, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you guys next time.